So what what happened uh, years ago? I, I know you're not only a food critic, but you're a food historian in many uh, in in a lot of regards. So what happened years ago that all of a sudden Italian restaurants seem to take over the scene? Well, it it took me a book which is called How Italian Food Conquered the World to deal with that subject. But the simplest answer is what Neil Simon, the uh, Canadian uh, playwright, once said. He says, there's two laws in the universe, the law of gravity and everybody loves Italian food. <laughs> and that is simply proven to be true, um, at least after World War II. Um, it became the most beloved so-called ethnic food and then moved into the spotlight, as you say, because of pizza and some chains, not always very good, um, that um, Italian food and the flavors in Italian food, which is cheese and bread under a pizza and tomato and pasta, these are very lovable uh, foods, the same, the same as in Mexican foods, uh, are not radically different, uh, different spices and so forth. But to go back, and, and what I treat in the book is that there wasn't any such thing as Italian food until 1860. 